Okay, Mark Reviews Places today. This is Pizza Pie Cafe in Highland, Utah. There's several locations up and down the Wasatch Front. This actually started in Idaho um, as a place called Crego's Pizza, and then they rebranded to franchise this. So this particular location, uh, to give you a sense of place, this is the shopping center with Ridley's. That's American Fort Canyon down there, and this is SR92 that runs this way. So. Uh, we are right here, Pizza Pie Cafe in Highland. Uh, it says Real American Pizza on the sign, but really this is pizza, salad, and pasta. Um, salad, specifically, is, is probably their weak point, if I'm honest. Um, pretty much nothing on that. The salad bar is fresh. It's all prepackaged stuff, including the lettuce. Um, so if you're coming here expecting something more like a sweet tomatoes or soup plantation, that's not what you're going to get here. This is stuff where they're opening containers and dumping it in. Um, the pizza is really good. It's made fresh here. Uh, all the dough and toppings um, are applied by their army of high school employees. So pretty much everyone who works here is a high school student. Uh, the shirts, the uniforms that the people wear are a little bit sassy. They have funny sayings on them. Uh, about Chuck Norris and things like that. The one that's the most awkward and makes any grown man feel like a, a creeper or a pedophile is the one that says, stop checking me out. Every time I see that shirt, I'm like, well, I'm not. I just was reading your shirt. <laughs> you get the idea. Anyway, there's, there's kind of a fun, uh, exciting atmosphere to this place. Uh, kind of like a non-alcoholic sports bar almost. They have TVs on, uh, typically showing sporting events. During the Olympics, the Olympics are on here. Uh, during local sports, you can catch BYU or Utah football games here. Um, good place to just come and hang out where you don't have to worry about how your kids are behaving. And that's mostly because there are children running around and uh, serving their own food and doing kinds of things that make uh, more more uh, uptight parents maybe stress out a little bit but uh, stop by pizza pie cafe if you haven't reasonably priced um, not a really great bargain though uh, you gotta catch the coupons in your local mailer or you can sign up for their texting club uh, one last note too there are vegetarian vegan options here like the salad bar potentially if you do it right um, they do have a gluten-free option as well in their crust there is an extra cost associated with that, and they used to do all-you-can-eat gluten-free, where they would just make you tons and tons of gluten-free gluten pizzas. Uh, I'm told by one of my friends who has to come here on a regular basis um, you know, to get gluten-free things that they don't do that anymore, so he hasn't been for a long time. You know, you pay per pizza. They do have a takeout option, which always kind of puzzled me, so you can order something and then take it out. If you're going to get takeout pizza, get something else. Um, you know, Domino's, Little Caesars. They understand takeout a little better. This is really just meant to be mass quantities of cheap pizza with cheap ingredients. But it is really good. Um, personal favorite here, and something they're known for, is one called Spudalicious. So it's kind of like an Alfredo cheese sauce and uh, mozzarella cheese and then potatoes and chives and things like that. Almost like eating baked potato on top of your pizza. Sounds weird, but it works. So try that when you're here. All right, that'll do it for this particular Pizza Pie Cafe location. Um, tends to be organized chaos nights and weekends. If you can catch them off peak hours, it's a pretty relaxed atmosphere. Um, great for families. And you know, the, the food is good, not great, but it's an all you can eat pizza buffet. So what do you expect? That'll do it. Subscribe to this channel and uh, let me know what you think. Do you like Pizza Pie Cafe? Have you been here? Um, you know, CeCe's Pizza and other places have a bigger presence nationally, but this one is pretty successful here in Utah. Keeps expanding. Uh, locations that I've been to, this Highland one, Orem, and uh, also down in Provo. So try them out. You probably have one close to you.